few years ago, I created Essential Motion because I thought that probably more editors would like to use the motion presets that I find so useful. And a few months ago, I realized that the prompts I find myself creating and using more and more often are the next breakthrough in the editing efficiency. So if you ever asked yourself how to streamline your editing process to efficiently handle large volumes of footage while balancing client demands for faster turnaround times, then this video is for you. And by the end of it, I'm gonna explain how you can get what I'm about to show you for free. Let's dive in. A few months ago, I was editing a promo video for a client and the source material were webinars they run for a few weeks. Almost 20 hours of source footage to squeeze into two minute long video. And it wouldn't be a big deal if not for the fact that I only had two days to deliver the first cut. I thought to myself, I have to use AI to basically extract valuable one-liners from those webinars. Up to this point, I was only using AI to play with it, to test it. But other than using Eddy AI, which I'm gonna make a video on in the future, so subscribe, I didn't use AI for actual editing. But feeling like I have a knife to my throat, I learned a bit about prompt engineering, wrote a prompt, rewrote it, and eventually got to the point where I got useful answers. Lo and behold, essential prompts were born. It's a set of 20 prompts, although that number might increase in the future. Some are designed to help you build an assembly edit faster, some are there to help you prepare the video for YouTube, and some are designed to suggest, brainstorm, and analyze possibilities, the potential of the edit. And each prompt is split into five sections. Context that sets up the role for the AI, instructions where the task is explained, guidelines where the constraints and details are specified, placeholder sections where you can copy-paste the transcript or other user-provided data. Alternatively, you can leave this section empty if you uploaded the transcript file instead. And the output format example where AI learns how to structure the answer and what a good example looks like. Thanks to this structure, the prompts work reliably and return useful, valuable answers for people like you and me. I also made a companion website to make accessing and using these prompts as easy and handy as possible. Simply choose the prompt you want to use. Each has a number so that once you learn it, you don't even have to read the prompt's name anymore. Next, you simply click copy prompt and you're ready to use it with a suggested tool or the one you're most familiar with. This way you don't have to drag select anything, just a simple click. But if you want to, you can always click on the details to see the prompt before using it or even expand all of them, but the collapsed view is the most elegant and useful. Shall we see it in action? Let's try prompt number six, hinge clip finder. It finds short turning point lines with timestamps and explain why they matter. I copied the prompt and pasted it into ChatGPT. I already added transcription file from my interview with Jim Cummings and very quickly we get 10 strong hinge clips we can select and use in the edit for a teaser of this interview for example. And just looking at this I can tell that it did a really good job identifying important strong bits that can be used as a shift in tone or changing the topic of the conversation. Okay so how much is it? You can get essential prompts with pay what you want model. If you want it for free, you will get a PDF version where you have to copy paste the prompts manually, but the prompts are exactly the same. But if you contribute $10 or more, you get a web version plus a companion walkthrough video. And if you decide to contribute, I really appreciate it. it gives me an incentive to create this stuff for you. So grab your copy of essential prompts and start utilizing AI in your editing workflow. It will save you more time than you think. See you next time.